Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on twin flames. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you're going through the twin flame experience, then I'm certain this reading will be enjoyable for you. So let's begin your tarot card reading. We're going to start with the energy of the person that you're dealing with. We're going to be looking at their perception of you in the past, and then we're going to be looking at the present. Okay, so the very first card to have come up for the past energies is an indication of the love that they experienced when they met you. It feels as if the two of you were connected at the hip, a very beautiful, beautiful energy. And I'm getting the impression here that both you and this person concerned came together in a very harmonious sort of way. It feels as if it's divine intervention. There were greater forces at work. And this feels like a meeting of the minds. It also feels as if it was a deep spiritual and physical attraction. So this individual, when they saw you, they felt an instant recognition and an acknowledgement of what um, you know it is to have those type of feelings. They may have thought that they were at the beginning stages of falling in love. I am getting a very specific message that for some of you, the person that you're dealing with might not have understood the twin flame journey to a very great extent, right? It feels as if there may have been a lot of um, experiences of pain before you came along. That's what I'm getting from this particular energy. And so when the two of you met, it felt quite powerful. That's what I get from that card. Yeah, I feel like this individual was very attracted to your emotional nature. They felt a very distinctive connection to your feminine side if you are a female. Of course, men and women, you know, they have masculine and feminine energies. So you can apply both ways. Now with this particular card and this one, it feels like They were searching for you all along. There might have been someone else in the picture at the time. If not, this could have been, you know, a difficult situation they were experiencing as well. Because I'm picking up complications here, just from how the combinations have come out. Yeah, as I mentioned before, I even looked at this card. For some of you, you're dealing with the energy of a very complicated situation. It could be that there were more... There one individual involved and there was a difficult decision, but you and this individual were connected at the hip. That's what I'm getting. I'm also getting that um, it was you versus the world. They felt safe in your presence, right? They also felt protected. They felt uh, complete. So if this individual was the type of individual that, you know, was going through life and... Uh, getting in relationships that were very painful, it feels as if when you came along, that went away. But then there's also this energy of trying to keep this connection afloat because there were complications here. For some of you, the person you're dealing with, not all of you, right? This is a very small, small handful of you because this is adding a different dimension to it. There could have been other complications here, such as uh, this person having to make a decision or having to make a choice. But it feels as if the two of you were connected on a spiritual level and they didn't want to lose this connection, right? Because they just found it and they felt it was very special to them. So let's see. Let's see how they look at you now.
Okay, so there is some sort of conflict, but it doesn't feel like conflict. It feels like another energy. It's just that the two people here are tussling with each other. So, feels like this person is fighting against something. Feels like this individual that you're dealing with wants to reach out, potentially, right? But they are being too minded about this. On one hand, they want to. On the other hand, they don't. Not wanting to reach out could be coming from a place of fear. But it feels like this person needs to make a decision. And it's incredibly difficult for them to do so. I'm getting the impression from the card that is present here that this individual has either, you know, been very passive or withdrawn in some shape or form. There's an element of um, their nature that is very hidden from you right now. I feel like they're thinking about it a lot. But it's very hard for them to make this decision that they need to make in this situation. Let's have a look and see what is affecting them. For some of you, I feel like this individual is really held back by circumstances. I feel like they feel like they've been dealt with a bad hand when it comes to life, right? So that can mean that their circumstances and certain elements of their life have been such a source of, um, you know, sadness, regret, misery, pain, emptiness, loss, suffering, those type of energies. And they themselves could find, you know, that uh, they could be, you know, in a relationship that they are unhappy in. If not, they could be um, different religions to you. If that's not the case, it could be certain expectations of them. But whatever the circumstances are, it feels like this individual looks at uh, their life and the way that things worked out prior, prior to you coming along in a way in which they feel like they wish they knew then what they know now because they wouldn't have made certain decisions they made along the way. They wouldn't have found themselves in those situations where they might have been settling for things that um, they didn't really want or didn't really satisfy them to that extent. It's a very, you know, distinctive sort of energies. I do feel like there's some element here that is complicating the situation. This individual is at war. They don't know whether they should reach out or not. They are keeping a lot of their emotions to themselves. I also feel like they feel anguish about the fact that, you know, they are in a certain set of circumstances. Whatever is keeping the two of you apart, I feel like they really languish in the misery of it. It doesn't really bring them happiness. They have a regret about something that uh, they may have done prior to meeting you or maybe they made a choice whilst they knew you and uh, that choice went against this twin flame union. 
And that's where that great regret is coming from and the misery that is uh, uh, troubling them to a very large extent. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these energies on an extended reading. I'm going to be looking at the mind, heart and soul of this individual. Why do they feel so conflicted to reach out, right? And, you know, what is going to help them to make a decision in your favor? I'm also going to be looking at their deeper feelings at this moment in time as well as evaluating where they truly stand in the situation and how you should move forward from a strategic point of view. I hope you guys enjoyed your reading. You can find the link in the description box below. Have a wonderful day and take care.